Hi, this is Maths 3000. Today I'm going to show you how to draw a tree diagram uh, on picking two balls from a bag where the first ball is replaced into the bag before the second one is chosen. This is also known as independent events. Okay, so let's go straight into the example then. So, two balls are chosen from the bag. The first ball is replaced before the second ball is chosen. So we've got to draw a tree diagram showing the outcomes and probabilities of choosing two balls from the bag. So let's get started then. So if we start on the left hand side of the page. So if we do two lines over here. So this is for our first ball that we're going to pick from the bag. So we can either pick a black ball or a red ball. So since there are three black balls, we're going to put the probability of picking a black here, which is would be three fifths. And for a red ball, the probability of picking a red ball will be two fifths. Okay, so these are our branches for our first ball. So Let's follow the top route now of our tree diagram. So, first of all, then we've picked out a black ball. So, what can we pick out on our second ball? So, our second ball, we can pick out a black or a red ball. So, remember that I've put the first ball back into the bag now. So when I work out the probability of the second ball, it's not depending on what we picked out previously. So the probability of picking a second black ball would still be 3 out of 5. And the probability of picking a red ball would be 2 out of 5. Similarly for the bottom route, if I've picked out a red ball, I've then put the ball back into the bag. So I then can again pick out a black or a red ball and these probabilities will be the same because we've got the same amount of balls in the bag still. So we've just got, got to work out now the probabilities of picking two balls from the bag. So if we follow the top route of the tray diagrams, this is picking out a black and a black ball. So to work out the probability of picking two black balls, we multiply the two probabilities together. Make sure you multiply them, not add them. So 3, 3 is a 9, 5, 5 is a 25. So the probability of two black balls is 9 25ths. Another outcome would be to get a black ball first followed by a red ball. So this would be 3 fifths times two fifths again times the top numbers which is six times the bottom which is twenty five uh, other outcome would be a red ball followed by a black ball so I multiply the probabilities along the branches so this is two fifths times three fifths which is six twenty fifths and our bottom root of our tree diagram <coughs> would be two red balls. So this is two fifths times two fifths, which is four <coughs> twenty fifths. So these are all our outcomes that we have here with the probabilities. You can check that this is correct because all these should add up to a whole one. If you add these up, it gives you 25 out of 25. Um, thanks for watching this video. If you're looking for more videos on tree diagrams, there is one more video where the ball is not replaced. So this is a little bit harder to do because the probability of picking a second ball would depend on what you picked out previously. Uh, thanks for watching the video.